Brooke Shields is revealing how Bradley Cooper came to her rescue after she had a seizure. Brooke shares that Bradley rushed to her aid when she suffered a grand mal seizure before a performance of her previously owned by Brooke Shields' one-woman show. The 58-year-old recalls the incident in a Glamour magazine interview published on November 1st, saying, quote, I was preparing for the show and I was drinking so much water, and I didn't know I was low in sodium. Everything starts to go black, then my hands drop to my side and I go head first into the wall. I start having a grand mal seizure. The seizure left her, quote, frothing at the mouth, totally blue, trying to swallow my tongue. The actress adds that the next thing she remembers was being loaded into an ambulance with the actor, her co-star in the 2008 film The Midnight Meat Train, by her side. You wake up and Bradley Cooper's going, I'm going to go to the hospital with you, Brooke, and he's holding my hand, and I'm looking at my hand. I'm looking at Bradley Cooper's hand in my hand, and I'm like, this is odd and surreal. The actress explains that the restaurant sommelier had initially tried to call her husband, Chris Henchy. She adds, quote, His assistant called Bradley and said, Brooke's on the ground. Chris isn't around. Go get her. And he came. And somebody called the ambulance. And then it was like, I walked in with Jesus. Brooke did go on to explain that she had just consumed too much water while preparing for her big debut, and her body was low in sodium, explaining that the doctors told her, quote, I had too much water, I flooded my system, and I drowned myself, and if you don't have enough sodium in your blood or urine or your body, you can have a seizure. <laughs> 